Hey everyone, today I wanna to go over something I've been having a lot of fun with personally lately. It is making custom GIFs with Jiffy. And so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fire up PicMonkey and I'm gonna do a blank generic square of a 2000 by 2000 square area. And then I'm going to change the template background color to transparent. So what is special about a GIF is it just takes a collection of photos or images that you have and puts them together and makes action or animation. You can do it with video, you can do it with still images. I am going to do it as an example. I thought this one was really cute for Valentine's Day. I did two hearts from the PicMonkey graphics area and they have their own, which was under the accents. So here are two hearts and then I just decided to make those hearts larger and then make them more of a hot pink, neon pink type of color for Valentine's Day. And this is really it, this is all I needed to do. And then I exported this first photo as a PNG. And then all I did was go back into the graphic adjustment and then flip that image so that it was the opposite direction. And instead of on the top left, then it was the top right for the heart. And then I exported that second photo separately and I just put them in order. Now that I have my two images, I'm actually done with PicMonkey and I am gonna go over and show you the website called jiffy.com. Now, I think I made a mistake the first time I tried to do this and I'm just gonna show you what I mean. I went directly into the Jiffy um, Create and I went to choose your own photo or, or GIF and I went in and I uploaded the two images with the transparent backgrounds of the two hearts and then when I did it, I didn't think that they were um, transparent when the sticker came out, so maybe that was something that I did as a mistake. So I wanna show you an alternative that I did instead, which I think made it end up looking better. So I'm gonna go to a new website and it was called gifmaker.me. And so I'm gonna upload my images here. You can select multiple images, but I just went ahead and uploaded my two hearts again. And then it's gonna show me a preview window. And then I even increased the canvas size just a little bit. I wanted it a little bit larger. And then I can change the animation speed for the pictures to rotate to go faster or slower. I decided to speed it up just a little bit. And you can have it just keep repeating or you can have it do a certain amount of times in the loop before the animation ends. And then all you have to do is hit create GIF animation and it's going to process it for you. And then there is a link where you can just download. And then I took that GIF that I had just created and I downloaded it to my computer and then I went back to the Jiffy upload and I'm gonna hit back because I don't want that one that I was playing with. I'm gonna upload this one. And you can see that this one, the animation is already happening and it's gonna allow you to do different things like you can add text or different colors. I decided to throw a filter on this one since I'd already done the pink one for Valentine's Day um, just to play around with it. I thought maybe I'll try it in a rainbow and then I decided that would be a cool variation, but I'm gonna just run through some of the different items that they have as options. But I did decide that rainbow was the most fun for now. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach that uh, it, filter to it and then upload. And then you can add tags, I think, so that you can become more searchable just like any other platform. So I put like rainbow hearts and my name and I gave it a rating of G and then I said upload. And then when it goes to the upload section, it's also going to show up under my channel. Now I am not an expert at this and I've just started creating. I've only been on there like maybe a week and a half, but I wanna show you, I'm having some success with this already. I wanna show you what happens when I go to my dashboard area. So I've made 14 now and I've had 64,000 views on them and I think the pink hearts was very timely because of Valentine's Day. But if you look at my channel right there, right? My little floating hearts in pink are right there. So I wanna show you what happens when you get onto your cell phone. So on your cell phone, you can open up the app or you can go to the website, but here's my channel, all of my gifts. And I think I'm gonna add it to an Instagram item. So I'm gonna open up Instagram, just take a photo real quick here of my hand and black screen and then I'm going to go back into Jiffy and you see there's a button that says copy and then you can copy it and you'll see it come up as add sticker and because of the transparent background you only see the dancing hearts so I think this is pretty cool you can create your own bring them in 
So I want to say thanks to Jiffy for creating kind of a cool program so that I can have my own custom GIFs. And I don't want to get into a debate about GIFs versus GIFs because, oh man, that's a whole bag of worms I'm not ready for. But yeah, I hope that helps, guys. And uh, thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I put out a new video every week. I can't wait to hang out with you guys again. I'll see you very soon. Bye!